Um, obviously going into the game we knew it was going to be a difficult, uh, difficult night. Um, so Bramma had to, to try and get all three points and um, to go two 0 up in the first I think it was fifteen minutes. Then we were for us to die and um, I was just just uh, so happy with the win. Paul, well, the road was bouncing. What role do you feel the supporters played on the night? Ah, they were massive for us from, from the first minute to the last. They were right behind us. Um, also, it was great to get a three 0 advantage early in the game and. Um, after that, they were just singing constantly, and, and the atmosphere at the end when we came back out was was amazing. How challenging mentally do you feel this season's been for you? Because from the outset, we have been near the foot of the table. We've now survived. We preserved our SPL status, but just how difficult has has it been? Because there's been a fair amount of criticism. Yeah, it's been difficult. Um, yeah, as you said, near enough the whole season we've been around the bottom of the league and. Just this is our most weeks and um, it's tough to take and but um no nah, mentally it's it's hard but we've came through it now um hopefully in the coming seasons it, it makes us all stronger as a group as a young defender obviously you're still learning your trade in a team that perhaps isn't functioning properly has it been difficult at times have you found yourself perhaps feeling that your confidence is being hit yeah at times your confidence is low but everyone's confidence was low in the and it's because when you're not winning games, it's it's hard to, to keep your confidence up. Um, as a defender as well, we're conceding too many goals um, for the majority of the season, and it's disappointing. But no, I just like we've, we've came through it now, and, and we're, we're safe, as you said. How would you sum up your recent form? You've got player of the year last year. Your recent form is probably even better than that. Would you agree with that? Yeah, I've been happy the last few months. Um, I think my form's been not too bad. Um, Dotted to get a couple of goals, obviously one against Dunfermline and then one against Dunbar Ness as well. So hopefully next season try another a couple more. I've got a smile on my face about the goal against Dunfermline. It was a tremendous strike, don't get me wrong. Um, did you think immediately that it had crossed the line? Uh, I know that it's kind of um, struck up all these debates now about getting goal line technology introduced into Scottish football. Uh -huh. What was your take on events? Nah, if you if you've seen my reaction, I was I was pretty sure it wasn't over the line. To be honest, um, I went away kind of gutted that I hadn't went in, and then it wasn't until I turned back around and all the, everyone's jumping on me and things like that. It was, nah, it was it was strange, but like the goal was going. So the linesman get your uh, goal bonus or a, a little a nice thank you present. <laughs> I think you might have maybe a ten on me for the second half goal or something like that. But um, nah, it was, it was just like that he gave it. I was surprised as well, but. Um, no, I've done quite well to, to get in the position, so um, for it to be given a goal at the end, I was obviously done.